Hi, I'm Celia Chang of Cravings. Today, we're visiting graphic designer Louise Feely at her studio to talk about her new book, Elegantissima. The book is a monograph of her works that spans a nearly 40-year career, starting from the first time she visited Italy at 16 and fell in love with food, type, and all things Italian, through her tenure at Pantheon Books, to the opening of her own studio, Louise Feely Limited, where she branched out into restaurant identity, food packaging design, and more. Hi, Louise. Hi, Celia. So why did you decide at this point in your career to do a monograph? Well, this monograph was actually the result of a bet that I had with Matteo Bologna. We were having lunch one day, and he said to me, when are you doing a monograph? And I said, when are you doing a monograph? And the next thing I know, we had a wager going, and I went straight back to the studio laid out the whole, whole book with dummy type, and two weeks later I started sending it to publishers. Wow, that's really amazing. <laughs> so the book is full of great anecdotes, the conclusion being one of them. Can you share it mm. with us? Oh, yes. Well, I was once on my way back from Italy um, by way of Paris, where my connecting flight was hopelessly delayed. And uh, I found myself reflecting on the meaning of life, which I guess is normal. And I was thinking to myself, so I've designed some nice book jackets and a couple of good logos, but I've never saved a life doing that. So finally we boarded and everyone was on a short fuse. Uh, soon after takeoff, the attendant came around to dinner service and blurted out her question. She, she just said, chicken or fish? And the poor young man sitting next to me, who was of undetermined ethnic origin, looked at her blankly. So she just eyed him and said, Francais, Italian, and st still continued blank stare. So uh, finally I jumped in and gave some other options and he, he, he caught on and, and brightened and said, Ruski! So um, what does she do? She throws him a menu that's in English and French and she starts to walk away. And I thought, oh my God, if I don't do something right away, this poor man is going to starve. So I grabbed my pen and grabbed his menu and as fast as I could, I drew this. Young Vladimir, of course, chose the chicken, and I, I got the validation that I was seeking through graphic design. I had kept someone from going hungry. <laughs> Thank you so much, Louise. You're welcome. Thank you, Celia.